And there's all the neighborhood children for this little community. I just gave out some some sweets, so they all got some candy. And if if one of the, if I miss one of them, they said this one, no candy, no candy. <laughs> Say hello, hello. <laughs> So you can see how this works. That will be an extended place there for putting for putting utensils, kitchen, cooking ware. And this, as you will have seen in the past, this is the open cooking. Uh, this, this is actually what they cook on. This will be filled with soil. And then they'll have the barbecue, what you might call barbecue stuff, will go on to here. And it will be left open at the top there, so that it doesn't kill everybody with, with, with the fumes from the fire. And you can see that this has all been made with basic tools. Look at that. Actually, that looks like um, looks like a real lash up of a hammer. So that's a steel tube and they'll use that often to bend nails to make hinges and to bend rebar so it has its function. And the thing is that you see that you see here that lots of people will be saying, oh no. Why are the children on a building site? It's the Philippines. And, and kids are not, which is not considered a huge burden. And, and these kids are watching this built and they'll be enjoying part of it too. It's open doors. When I was a kid, it was open doors too, where I lived in Manchester. But of course we didn't walk in and out of other people's houses, but here they do. So I think we're done here, Beth. Yeah. We've got lots to do today. So thanks for looking in. This is Terence Beth Martin giving hope. And we're looking at house 42.